next in the UFC Heavyweight Division Collision. Well, there is no denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kick. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he hides very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it, he will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters with similar height and the same reach. Now for the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 10 wins, no losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, lights out. And now introducing his opponent, Fighting out of the red corner. A kickboxer holding a professional record of 23 wins, five losses. He stands six feet five inches tall, weighing in at 247 pounds. Fighting out of Monterey, Mexico, Priceless. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? This young man won his last fight by knockout. No TKO plus knockout for him the last time out. And now he is getting a shot against a truly elite fighter in this division. The question is, when the challenges get stiffer, will his game raise up to that next level? Throughout his career, when the challenges have gotten tougher, he has raised his game. That is... Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to chase that finish down now. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom. Oh, he's still looking to finish now because he's got it from the very back. Oh, nice elbow. Oh, he's out. Oh, my goodness. You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short knife 
for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC, and he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes to his hands, but ultimately it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 29 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he sleeps.